Hello, my beautiful gamers, and welcome back. It's me, Siren, and today we are on another episode of Disney Dreamlight Valley. Now, we are finally going to finish Minnie's friendship quest. And yes, I have not yet finished it. I know Minnie has been in the game for like ever and I've had her for such a long time. But new characters keep coming in so then I prioritize them and do their friendship quests. And poor Minnie kind of just got lost in the background. And that's sad and regrettable because I really like her and I love the reward she gives you when you finish her friendship quest. Friendship quest. Oh, we're off to a bad start already. But yeah, and then when we're finished with Minnie, if there's time left, I might even do Goofy, because I'm almost done with Goofy as well. And yeah, then they are finally done, and I can walk around in my valley in peace without them yelling at me that they need help. <laughs> so if you're curious to see what happens and how we build Minnie's enormous tower that takes way too much resources, then stick around. <laughs> and let's game. Okay, so here we are, ready to go talk to Minnie. Hi! I'm finally ready to do your quest. Can Look, you believe it? Here. Oh, Siren, I'm so glad to see you. Isn't this a charming village? I'd love to pick some of the beautiful flowers. It is a lovely village, Amir Masil. <laughs> Would you like to do that with me? Sure, I'd love to help you, Minnie. Wonderful! I saw lovely blue flowers in the forest. Let's go pick some together. I might even give them to that charming Mickey. Oh, it's strange that she refers to him to that charming Mickey and not to charming Mickey or to my charming Mickey. But she said that. That's kind of strange. I don't know. Oh. Or maybe I shouldn't. Oh, I'm so embarrassed that I don't remember him. Oh yeah, oh yeah, recap. She lost her memories and then we did a lot of effort to get her back after the forgetting uh, and she can't entirely remember Mickey. The laughter of flowers. Pick blue star lilies in the forest with Minnie. Okay, are you gonna follow me, Minnie? Yes. She's saying the forest, so I'm assuming the forest of Valor. And she wants blue flowers. That's not a problem. Um, I do think you can cheat this, by the way. Not like actually cheated. You can pick up... Am I at the right place, though? I know these flowers are purple. Ooh, hello there. Nice to see you. Love to see it. Uh, I do believe if you have flowers in your inventory... You can just throw it out of your inventory and pick it up, and it should count. See, I have one flower now. Argument's sake, if I throw it out, drop, I can just pick it back up, and then I have two flowers, even though I only have one in my inventory, because the objective says pick flowers. It doesn't require you to have the flowers, it only requests you to pick the flowers. Um, I do have some of these flowers in my storage though, so if I do need the right amount, I can just simply go get them. <laughs> but there's a little cheat for you guys. It doesn't always work this way. Sometimes when you throw it out of your inventory, it's going to say zero again, because it actually wants you to have the specific flowers in your in inventory. But in a case where it just specifies pick doing, the flower, you can you can take the cheat approach and just drop the two blue flowers and pick up the two blue flowers and there you have it bob's your uncle um i'm gonna do that because it's easier and like i said this isn't actually like a cheat this is in the game this is how the game works um see make sure you have blue star lilies in your inventory now it actually requests me to have the flowers in my inventory and i'm just simply gonna travel to my house and go get some more blue star lilies um again i know this is a bit cheaty but i do have the flowers so i just feel it's it saves hello hello there you go. It saves you so much time to just simply where's my flower box it's the first one isn't it yeah 
It saves you so much time to just simply grab the flowers you need. I think this is enough. And then you can just quickly go in there. Okay, good. Now we have our six flowers and I can give it to Minnie. Hiya. Oh, thank you, Siren. It's so nice to see flowers again. When I was in the in-between place, I felt safe, but there was no color. So it was a little sad. These flowers are the perfect remedy. You know, I think I'd like to give them to that kind fellow I met, Mickey. Could you help me make a nice arrangement for him? I have the vase we need right here. All it needs is flowers. We can fit it in with the hydrangeas, bellflowers and star lilies we picked. Yeah. Oh, it has a little bow on it. Thank you. Craft Minnie's flowers. Oh, I will. Where are they? Uh, there they are. Oh, I can't make more than one. What a pity. I do love them. This is so sweet. Continue. So sad that she forgot Minnie. That but, ugh, Mickey. Scatter brain. Oh. It looks perfect, Siren. I hope Mickey will like it. Mickey will adore it. What do you mean, like it? His name was the only memory I held onto in that other place. Could you deliver it for me, please? I'm still embarrassed that I don't remember him. Of course, Minnie! Oh, Minnie, do you mind if I quickly take a selfie with you? No, but there's a, a night thorn. You know, I shouldn't be taking the selfie now, but I want to. Mini? Yeah, yeah. No! They both blinked! I'm saving it. Oh, that's so cute. I love it. Yay. Sorry you guys have to see me take photos, but... Ah! So, that just happened. Mickey? Oh, Mickey. I should just check my map. Are you in the restaurant? Everyone just ran over to Sunlit Plateau. Mickey! Mickey? Um, Mickey? Merlin? Mickey? Where's Mickey? Guys? 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 I'm not finding Mickey Mouse. Mickey Mouse is gone. I have a problem. Where is this damn mouse? Minnie? Minnie, I lost Mickey. I'm gonna go into his house. Maybe he's in here. <gasps> When last have I seen Mickey? That's the real question. Oh no. Do you guys think another one of my quests are broken? No, surely I'm just not seeing Mickey. Surely that's the case. Let me have a look around. And hopefully find him. Oh, crisis averted, I found him. Mickey? Why are you here? Oh, Mickey, stop moving! Oh, hi. Here you go. I I came with presents. Hi. Flowers from Minnie? Gosh, that sure is nice of her. No. Say, how is she doing? Does she remember anything new? She remembers flowers. There's still hope. You bet there is, Siren. Thank you for helping her. Yeah. Oh, and would you thank her for the flowers? Call me or messenger, Mickey. I got you, man. I got you. Return to Minnie. Minnie, are you still where I last saw you? Or are you in an entirely different dimension by now? Because when you do quests for these characters, they make sure that once you're done with them, they scatter. Oh, hello! Did Mickey like the flowers? He did. He misses you. Oh, I feel like this is going to put pressure on her. He did. Oh. oh, I'm so glad. This situation certainly is strange. I feel like I should know him. But I don't. Not yet you do. Maybe talking to him will help you with your memories. Oh, that makes me a little nervous, but I can try. Congratulations! Yay! Next! I'm so glad you came by! 
Oh, I'm so glad you're here, Siren. I've made an interesting discovery. Since I got here, I've been very drawn to the same part of the village. The peaceful meadows. Meadow. I feel like there is something calling me there. Could you help me figure it out? That's great! Of course I'll help you! Thank you. The meadows always make me happy. And it feels familiar. I'm so glad I put your house in the meadows. Especially near the pond. Come with me, I'll show you. I hope it's the pond over there. Because I put your house by that pond. <gasps> yes! Look, this is her house and her cute little garden. And... There's nothing there, okay? A fishing rod. Should we fish something out of the pond? Hmm? Oh. This place feels familiar to me. Siren, do you see that strange thing? It's flickering in and out of reality, just like you were. Is that a fishing pole? First one. Was that what I looked like? Oh, goodness. How did you bring me back? A device called the Dream Magnifier. A device? Mickey has it. I'm going to explain to her what's going on. How interesting. Let's go ask Mickey about it. <laughs> Mickey? <gasps> Do you guys think he's still up there? Or did he do what they always do? And once you're done talking with them, they scatter. They run. They, they're they like, I will make your life difficult and I shall run to infinity and beyond. So that you shan't find me in your endeavor. Yeah, no. Ah, Mickey? 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 Oh, Mickey! What, what are you? Why? I don't like coming here because it's full of orbs that I don't pick up because I'm lazy and people are going to judge me. Hi. Mickey, we found so We found a floating sparkling fishing pole. I thought it's a fishing rod. Floating and sparkling? Huh. That's kind of how Minnie looked when she was lost. Hot dog. What can I do to help? Uh, could we borrow the dream light magnifier? Do you think these... Th blah, 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 blah. Oh my gosh. Do you think these things are stuck in the here and there? Of course. Here, take it. Thanks. Bring the dream light magnifier to the fishing pond. Why would I run? I can just teleport there. Okay. Let's see. Pick up. It vanished. Okay. Oh, the quest was delayed. I don't know if you saw. The quest was delayed. I was so panicked there for a moment. Okay, Minnie. What do you have for me? Siren, I remember something. Yes. I remember fishing here with Goofy. But it wasn't for fun. It was important. Then we went to the beach. And... Oh, the rest is fuzzy. Maybe something's at the beach. Will you help me remember? Let's go. Let's go to the beach. Each, let's go get away. <laughs> Ignore me. Ah, a seashell? Um, a hat? Donald, it's Donald's hat. The sparkling floating hats. Talk to Minnie. That works too. This is Donald's hat. Yes, I remember Donald. Donald Duck. Is the last one going to be Mickey? I was catching fish for him. He was about to go on a dangerous mission. So I was packing food for him. The mission was probably in the portal he jumps, I think. I don't know. I found Don Donald in the forest. Did you manage to bring it to him? Yeah, I found Donald in the forest. It's all adding up. The forest. I remember that. I followed Donald to give him his food for his journey. But while I was following him, something happened to me. Could we go to the forest? It's the last thing I remember. Let's go. Which way is... This way is faster.
Investigate the forest of valor to find another lost memory. She followed him. And the portal was somewhere back here. Um, yeah, literally where my beautiful house is. Um, that's awkward. Um, it's in my garden. I remember now. Donald was going to find the forgetting. I was running, trying to give him the supplies. But then a gust of wind caught me and spun me all about. And then I wasn't in the forest anymore. And there was no color. I was alone for a long time. I was so lonely. I missed Mickey! <gasps> I remember Mickey! Oh, he's the one I love! How could I forget? Oh, this is actually so sweet. I love it. My poor sweet Mickey. I have to find him. Run, Minnie! Run! Go see Mickey with Minnie. Oh. Okay, I'm still escorting. I see. Let's go find Mickey immediately. This is a dive... Oh, he's close. Can you believe... Can you believe it? Mickey, I have something important to share with you. It is Minnie and- Oh, <gasps> this is the perfect spot under the little veranda. Mickey, Mickey. Minnie, what's wrong? Are you okay? I'm wonderful. I remember everything. I remember you. You do? You do. Ha! <laughs> I knew you would. But Minnie, why are you crying? Oh, Mickey, I'm so sorry. I forgot I loved you. Gosh, Minnie, don't be sorry. It's not your fault. And you did, didn't forget me. Not really. Not in your heart. We never really forget memories. We keep in our hearts. You couldn't be more right. Oh, Mickey, I love you. And I want to make sure I remember that in my heart and in my head. We have to protect our memories from the forgetting. Oh, Gosh, I've got a lot to do today. Talk to Mickey. Oh, <laughs> Hey, where are you going? Okay, not far. Minnie! She's scampering off again. No, no, no. I think I just turned on the light. Mickey! Are you kidding me? Oh! Hey there! Siren, my sweetheart's back! <laughs> and she says you helped her remember. Gosh, I can't thank you enough. Here's the Dreamlight magnifier. Keep it safe in case we need it again. I've got a feeling we'll definitely need it again. I'll keep it safe and sound. Yeah, don't forget about it. Talk to Minnie. She ran off this way. There she is. On the little step. It's kind of sweet. Hi. Oh, good. You're here. I can't believe I forgot my dear sweet Mickey. He always tried to be cheerful. But I know it made him sad. I could see it in his face, even though he tried to hide it. Thank you for helping me remember. Oh, of course! On the trial of Minnie's memories. Let's continue! You came by. Siren, did you know there used to be a... Rustic clock tower in the plaza. Here it comes, the rustic clock. The infamous clock. It was quite large and elegant. And it helped everyone keep time. It seems to have disappeared during the forgetting. Would you help me bring back the Dreamlight Valley? Huh? To Dreamlight Valley. Of course I'll help you. I've prepared for this day for a very long time, Minnie. Wonderful. Now, let me see. It was very tall. Built of stone, hardwood and clay. Oh, and the clock hands were made of iron. Goodbye. Remembering Goodbye. old times. You. Talk to Minnie. Hello. You've gathered everything. Now all that's left to do is to craft the rustic clock. 
and find the perfect spot for it. <laughs> this is how you do quest in Dreamlight Valley. Boom, <laughs> you come prepared. Sorry, I'm getting very excited about this because I've I've known about this clock for quite some time. And I know a lot of people complained about the sheer amount of resources that it takes to build this singular clock. Um, but I am prepared for a change. Like, this is a lot, man. I do like the clock, though. I actually do think it's pretty. I shall find a perfect spot for it. Um, I think I want to put it close to where you are. How big are you? Oh, you're not that big. I would like to put it either here or right next to... Oh, it chimes as well? Is this the front? I believe this is the front. I feel like this is a good spot. What is this book? Very magical mini. Apparently, I just started another mini mouse quest. Um, before I do that, though, let me show you guys what I did. So, I didn't put the tower where I initially thought I was going to. I put it here. I just feel like it looks much better. And I just feel like this is such a good spot for it. Also, there is not supposed to be a massive gap there. That's 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 not how this is supposed to look. So just give me a second. Um, I don't know if this happens to you and in your game as well. So sometimes I would decorate something and place things and it would reset. So this is not how entirely how this looks, but this is how it looks now. Anyway. But yeah, I have like this little market here that I really, really like. And I just thought it would be nice to have the clock tower here by this market. I might expand this area, make it a bit bigger so that I can put like a little bench there. I think that would be cute. Wait, let me give it a shot quickly. Yeah, so maybe something like this, just a bit less smushed. So then you have like this cute little market area where you come can come sit. Check the time. I can't sit on the bench. To there you go. You know, something like this. I just think it's nice. Let me know what you think. I like it. I can also do something like this, though. Like, kind of move it to the side more. Anyway, let's go talk to Mini. Hopefully she's still where we need her to be. Then we can finish up her quest. Oh, I need to talk to you. Hello, Siren. I'm so glad to see you. Uh, let's complete... What is this very magical mini? Oh! You've done a wonderful job, Siren. The rustic clock tower looks as good as I new, both so elegant and amazing. useful. You know, seeing you do so many useful things reminds me of the cheerful clumsy club. What? That what's the cheerful Oh my word, I read clumsy! <laughs> <laughs> the cheerful chums club how how is that clumsy there's something wrong with me sometimes i like being useful what is this club <laughs> well i don't recall exactly who was in the club but i know we made sure everyone in the village had what they need if the club were around today i might just nominate you to be the president <laughs> oh before i forget i made these clothes yay i said thank you um ca can you please not i hope you like them i don't like them thanks though i thought i was gonna get the cute little dress no, I don't- I don't want them again! Goodness! Um, I want to do the rest of Minnie's quest, but I don't think I can because I have another quest for her. Let me check quickly. <laughs> yeah, so to do her next quest, I need her to be... I mean, her to be... Um, I need her... To be level 10, and I need Woody. Don't I have Woody? No, I have Buzz. Okay, well then we're gonna continue with Mini some other day. Shall I do a very magical Mini to continue on the theme? Or shall I do what I said I was going to do and go talk to Goofy? I do think I'm rather gonna go see what Goofy wants. 
Now, I know this is a very unpopular opinion, but I'm not too fond of Goofy. He's a sweetheart, but he does work on my nerves from time to time, if I'm being honest. Who's singing? You sing? I know you sing in the movies, but I thought that was just a movie thing. Goofy, can you please stop moving? Okay, let's see what Goofy needs. Hi there, pal. Hi there, Siren. I want to invite my pal Mickey over for dinner. Would you help me get everything ready? Sure, sounds nice. Only if you promise not to goof up. Oh boy, this is going to be the best dinner ever. I want to make us with fish seafood, fresh seafood. Let's go to the beach and catch some seafood. Uh, shrimps. Catch fresh seafood. Okay, okay, fine. It wants me to catch them, so I can't just go pluck them out of my storage, it would seem. Um, shrimp is easier. It's not that difficult to catch, but... Hmm, you get it in other biomes as well, and I do sometimes feel like it's easier to catch them there, or am I thinking about something else? Am I on the right track? I am not sure. I can walk through here, I promise. There we go. Let me try this spot. I feel like this is always the, the spot to go. Um. Where did he fling that? Okay. Never mind. This is gonna take a while. Yay! Yay! Could use some help. Uh, Goofy, I am helping you! He's like, Gorge, I can use some help. I'm helping you! Come here! How's it going? Oh, the fresh seafood gonna make a great meal. But it takes more than fish to make a bowl of ba It's gotta have tomatoes and some other vegetables. The recipe is pretty flexible. Would you go pick us a vegetable to add? Here, take the recipe. Um, I do believe I know how to make this already, but thanks. So long. Use. Cook the bowl by spell How? I should Google. Um, now to find it. Here it is. Autofill. Why? Why do you always insist, game, on using my Christmas fish? I have so many other seafood. I have so many other options you can choose from. But you insist to use my little Christmas hat ones. Use the shells, you know, the things you can pick up for free by the beach. Use that. But no! It insists... I've cooked one of my Christmas fish. I felt so bad because I've actually cooked one of my Christmas hat fish once. And I, I really... I was so sad and I felt so bad about it that I gave the meal to one of the villagers because I didn't want to eat it. Oh, I have to make two. Um, this stove is standing the wrong way around, I only now realized. But, yeah, I, I hate that the game does that. Like, what's wrong with you? Why would I want to eat a little fishy with a Christmas hat on? It really upsets me, in case you haven't noticed. Okay, Goofy. I'm literally making food for you. Why aren't you waiting for me? I just heard you sing. I heard you go, do, do, do. Where are you? You must be close. Oh, there you are. Okay, you were close. Never mind. I'm not mad at you anymore. You were just fishing close by. I appreciate that. Unlike Mini. <laughs> I'm, I'm always so salty when I play Dreamlight Valley. Thanks, Siren. It sure was fun fishing and cooking with you. It, it was fun. Yeah, I don't mind. Uh, you're not that bad. 
Oh boy, Mickey's gonna love this. Whoa. Oh. I'll tell you a secret about cooking and why I wanted to make the fish. The more fun a dish is to say, the more fun is it to cook. I don't understand. Oh, the more fun it is to say the name of a dish, the more fun it is to make. <laughs> Blown my mind. I don't know how to... Where's my phone? Be your best. Be your best. I still don't know how to say it. Um, um, yeah, cool. I, I'm sorry. <laughs> Dinner with a friend. Next! Hi there, pal. Hey, Siren. Remember the scrapbook you helped me start? Yes. Well, I thought we should add some more stuff to it, since you discovered new parts of the valley. It'll be fun. And it'll help us if the forgetting ever comes back. Sure, let's go. Great, I'll figure... Great, I figured we should start with important landmarks. There's a whole lot of them. The giant willow tree. The... Elephant graveyard. Uncle Scrooge's store, Remy's restaurant, and we can't forget get the castle. Okay, cool. Let's go. I'm sniffly. Well, this is easy. Uh, does that count? Can I be in the picture? Should I save them? Oh, oh, I like that. Yes, Goofy. You shall be in my thumbnail. Oh, I have Scrooge and Remy's restaurant in that one shot. But I don't have the castle. That's funny. Uh, I'll just take a picture of the castle. Can I do that? Um, apparently I cannot. Oh, this is possessed. Oh, help me. I shall do it like so. Yes. Did it count? Yes. Okay, Sandlet Plateau, the ele blah, blah, blah. elephant graveyard. What is an elephant, might I ask? In Afrikaans, it is a willyfant, for those of you who are interested. It's quite cute. Willyfant. Look at all those night thorns, photobombing. And then the beautiful willow tree where we found Mother Gothel herself. There we go. Boom. Beautiful. Goofy, thank you for following me. I appreciate it. Look at that. You got all our majestic landmarks. I'll add them to the scrapbook. Hmm. Now, what else would look good in our book? I know. How about if you take pictures of the pillars oh, you found? Those seem important. Probably should start with the first four. Um, there's one over here. Damn. He's really taking me through it. I hope that counts. Okay, good. Um, the next one is... Over here. Uh, where'd I put it? I actually... Have a little special spot for it. All like loud and proud. Boom. Uh, Dazzling Beach and the forest. I'm closer to Dazzling Beach, but I'm just gonna teleport to the forest. I can't actually remember where my forest pillar is because it used to be over there. Ah, it's it's over. Yeah, it's just <laughs> it's just standing there. Actually, I want to find nice places for them, but. You use them for a quest in any way later on, so... And now I can go get the one on Dazzling Beach. Which I have not done yet. Oh yes, I have. I haven't done the one at the back there. No, but this one I did. Ah, uh, that's a bit close, but I guess it works. Okay, Goofy, where are you? Ah, Goofy, where are you going? Are you coming t Oh! <gasps> Goofy, I take back everything I said about you. Look at all those fancy pictures in our scrapbook. Ooh. 
makes it feel real official gosh i think our scrapbook's almost complete but it's still missing something it's authors shiny stickers a publishing deal it's authors it needs photos of us or shiny stickers hey that's just what i was thinking a selfie of the two of us together if the forgetting ever comes again i wouldn't want to forget about our friendship oh and let's make it a formal picture that means you'll have to get <laughs> a hat too my favorite kind of hat is an everyday hat is a special hat is a silly hat i'll put on something a little silly for our photo together I should have said a special hat. Take a selfie with Goofy. No, he's just gonna wear his usual hat, so... Goofy! Aww. 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 My character... Ah! Do that again. Do it again, Goofy. <laughs> yes! I kinda need your help. Not now. Who sounds like that? Who, who said that? Like oh, you. Hi there, pal. Oh, that's a great hat. Just what our scrapbook needs. I'm real happy we captured this memory in a picture. <laughs> but my Yay! goofy voice is getting worse by the day. And we can make even more memories for the scrapbook. Oh. After all, that's what life is, isn't it? Making memories. Oh, Photo fever complete. Goofy, I have How one more in me. So, you sure look... <laughs> took some good photos of our scrapbook. Looks really professional. But I just realized it's missing an important part. Can you help me? Um, sure. But aren't scrapbooks a little out of... No, it sounds fun. If you want a scrapbook, scrapbook. Why am I talking to your tummy, though? Okay, here's what I'm thinking. We got pictures of plants, critters, landmarks, and even a picture of us. But we're missing pictures of other folks. I want to add photos of my best pal, Donald and Mickey. And you should add pictures of the folks you love. I need to take six pictures. Mother Gothel! Mother Gothel! Scar! No, I don't like him. His quest is broken. Um, okay. Let's go take pictures of the villagers in question. He wants one of... <gasps> Stitch! Wait, I need to crouch. Uh, crouch. Yeah! Oh, little baby Stitch! Yeah. Food. Let's go get Donald. No, this is Scrooge. Why do I always do that? I'm so sorry. Please tell me it's not just me. Okay, everyone is currently in Remy's restaurant. So I'm just gonna go in there and be like, Hey, can you take a picture with me? <laughs> While they're eating. Guys, never do this to someone. Is this gonna work? This is an awkward photo. Oh my gosh, it worked. Oh, I would be- I would feel horrible. I know there's people that does this to celebrities. They would, like, see them at a dinner table and they would go and, like, talk to them and ask for pictures. I would never do that. I would feel so bad to invade that, you know, alone time and private time. But I just did it in Dreamlight Valley. But but it's fine, because I do feel like I own this valley. It's mine. It belongs to me. <laughs> um, yeah, bad mentality. I don't care. It's a game. It's different. Scar! Must everyone here be so... And now what's the word? Happy? Nice. I feel you. It's kind of annoying. I'll crouch down for you. Thank you, little back scratchy. Never turn your back on me. Oh, you might think that you're scary, but I love you. You're just cute and cuddly. 
Okay, who's next? Who would I would like to take a little bit? Who shall I take pictures with? Who's my favorite characters that I actually have? Well, I absolutely love Vanellope, Ursula, and Ariel. They're some of my favorite Disney characters that I have in my valley. Ooh! Did you guys see there's an alleged leak that the next little DLC... Not DLC, I don't know what else to call it. But the next thing you might be able to buy in Dreamlight Valley. Um, oh, I can't go in there because it's not close enough. Problem solved. Um, is maybe Vanessa, who is essentially Ursula's human form. And that is something I am very excited about because you all know that I love Ursula. She's like one of my favorite Disney villains. She and Mother Gothel love them, adore them. Um, now, when I was little, I actually used to like Vanessa more than Ariel purely because Vanessa had dark hair and I think dark eyes. And me being a small little child that also had dark hair and kind of liked a feistier attitude and not necessarily your average Disney princess kind of thing. Like my favorite Disney princess of all time is Mulan, still to this day. I love her. Um, so yeah, I, I really loved Vanessa. It would be really cool to have her in me game where everyone's at their houses. I need a picture of Mother Gothel. She's iconic. <laughs> She just wanted to be beautiful and timeless and ageless. I mean, can't we all relate to that? Do me a favor, won't you, dear? I can't move my camera. No, Goofy, not you. Yes, you. Like, she's such a queen, I can't. Return to Goofy. Wow. Whoa, look at everybody. Our pals really make the scrapbook feel special, don't they? Ooh. Gosh, I think it's really to show, uh, ready to show folks, don't you? Absolutely. Are you sure there's nothing else? No. Well, then I'll let you find a nice place to put it. And it'll call everyone to come see. I'll, sorry. A little table with a scrapbook. No, not now. I love you, but stop bothering me. <gasps> Let's go place our little scrapbook in the village. Let's place the scrapbook in your favorite place in the village. I don't have a favorite place. I love my village. I love everything about it. Should I place it in an area with a good background? Oh, I don't have Ursula in my scrapbook or Moana. Love Moana. She's a waterbender. I do like this area because it's re it reminds me of like a city. Uh, where's my favorite place? I'll go put it in the meadows. The meadows is not my favorite place for those of you curious about it. It's just... I feel like it's pretty here. Why is there such a... Why does it look like this? Are we gonna have to take a picture? In case we're gonna have to take a picture, I will just put it here and then our background is going to be Goofy's house, I guess. I'm scared it asks for like a group selfie thing. You know? I'm gonna just put it there and hope for the- Yeah, I was right! Oh, Wait! Um, I don't like that the scrapbook's in the way. I can't see Mickey. I'm assuming this is gonna go into the scrapbook. I want to sit with my little fox, but I literally can't see. Well, I think that's the best we're gonna get. Oh, could you please help me? And now the photo book's gone. No, no. Goofy. How's it going? Now that we've got the scrapbook put together, I'm not afraid of the forgetting anymore. Here, why don't you keep a hold of it? I know you'll take good care of it. I gotta take my hat off to you, Siren. You did a terrific job. Whoa. Hey, you know what? I'm even gonna give you my hat. <laughs> As a thank you for the scrapbook. Don't worry, I got a spear. <laughs> Yuck. Thanks. 
See, Minnie gives you an adorable little polka dot dress. Scrapbook bliss! Complete! I'm finally done! With Goofy. I wanted to be done with Minnie as well, but then I accidentally picked up a sparkling book. But that is how it goes in Dreamlight Valley. Okay guys, on that peaceful note, this is the end of today's Dreamlight Valley episode. Not gonna lie, I actually really enjoyed it. It was so sweet and wholesome and Minnie and Mickey is back together again and we did a little scrapbook for, for Goofy and I actually really loved it. Took pictures of the villagers and I don't know, it was just sweet and cozy and warm and fuzzy, you know? <laughs> um, so I really enjoyed it, like I said, I hope you guys did too. If you did, let me know by leaving a little like. And if you have not already and you want to see more adventures, then stick around and subscribe. Also hit the notification bell so that you will be notified when I post a new adventure or a cozy Disney Dreamlight Valley video. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching. I hope everyone has a nice and sweet and wholesome day. You know, full of magic and wonderful things. Thank you so much for watching, and I shall see you in the next one.